Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting very to episodes one and two of Nyan Nyan by by Yoni. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there we go. There we go. <laughs> um, I have no idea what this show is about. From what I have seen, I'm trying to avoid trailers with this show. Um, but poster wise, while I, what I've seen, it just looks like four little kids doing like cute things together. So the cute girls do cute thing cliche. It could be just like a three or four series, um, season series of a slice of life. That's what it also kind of gives me from what I saw from the poster. But like I said, I know nothing about this. I'm really excited for this. This could be like how I was with Kayon or, um, is the order a rabbit? In a nutshell. But, you know, hey. We'll see. Other than that, it's gonna get started with episode one in three, two, one, go. Yeah, very much, yeah. Mm-hmm. I get that, you know, kid. Sky's the limit. You feel like, damn, I, you feel stuck and you want something else in your life, something better. And you feel like, hmm, am I going to be here for the remainder of my days? Like, am I going to be in my 30s living in an area I don't want to live in? Now, okay, I will say, Rin... I think I've seen her before. Either I've seen memes that she's been in or GIFs. There's probably a GIF of her I've used before on Twitter. You know what? Let me look that up real quick. We got time before the episode actually starts. Okay. 
Okay, it's not in my frequently used gifts, so let's see. Anime. Was she crying? She was doing something. It wasn't that gif. But I think that's her. Never mind. The episode stuff is starting. A transfer student involved. Take the recorder out. Is that supposed to be high? Well, that's because you're a first grader, baby. First grader kids don't get to do as much things as, like, what, three to high school? Were you two supposed to be on that bus? Mm. Well, you could tell them what happened. You want to do some exercises? Oh, she's in a really small, they're all in a small class. Hmm. You need a student? You have the floor. Okay. Mm. So what's a Tokyo girl coming out here and like, you know, the dead of I don't know what in the country. Okay. Yeah, that's a normal thing. <laughs> Please. All, but all in the same class, though. That's cute. Are you the only class? What? Are there going to be more of you later on in the other series?
I mean, but this is a big ass school. I didn't think about that when I was looking at the shoes. I'm thinking like, okay, more more kids coming. Nah. Oh my god. Does the school have leaks? Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh! Smart. I think it, it, it's a Tokyo thing for her. Remember, she lives in the city. It's just to be safe. It's a really peaceful area. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah, I, you know, Otaru, you're in the country now. You're not going to have certain things that you had in Tokyo. up 
It's so cute. What's his name? Goo? You can barely whistle though, honey! Did Hotaru tell you that? Jesus. Oh. No, you just live somewhere that's really nice and peaceful. And besides, I think if any of the three of you ever went to Tokyo, everyone's just going to say you have an accent. Like, um, like what's her face from Mazu Daigo? Good.
That's beautiful. I think it's pretty. <laughs> the music for this show is really nice. Like, oof. Damn. And this is only the first episode. The bus never comes. she's so cute Ren is adorable like oh shit okay first initial thoughts this is super adorable like oh my god it seems like we're getting maybe okay how can I word this you know how like the this well by the time this comes out it'll probably be it'll be episode seven okay this week's um no Quotan came out, right? And you know how it had like 18 mini stories and one, 18, 19 mini stories and one, plus the other episode and stuff and, into it? It feels kind of like that with this, but not really where I love the eye catches being several different ones where it's like, okay, here's one intermission to another and so on and so forth and such. Hotaru seems really sweet. All four of them are sweet, but the fact is. At the end of the day, it's only five kids. Five kids that go to this big by behind school. What is cute? <laughs> but yeah, it, it does give you the little bit of Azuma Dayo vibes. It has a little comedy in there at moments. But it really is, at the end of the day, a cute little slice of life with four girls in it. And, and they're adorable. And their friendship is already really cute. Another thing I do also like about this is that of course, episode one. You have Rin, homegirl, and her sister um, taking Hataru under their wing and such and becoming friends with her. Because we there's all been a time when we were all in school and the one thing that we've always hated, or even when you have a new job, when you are the new person in town and such. I am now currently... Excuse me. Um... 
feeling that with my new job, obviously. Can't really talk about much, but yeah, I've only been there. I, I, well, by the time this comes out, I'll be on day two. Um, but of course, the nervousness that you get, you're, you're trying to figure out what you want to be at this school, at excuse me, at this job, pretty much anywhere where you go to, because you're like, dude, how am I, how is everybody going to perceive me and such? And so you want to be on your, your, to, your cues and toes, like your toes, basically, regardless of anyone. And you want to treat everybody the way that you treat it. You're, you, it's like that. I cannot speak. Oh my God. <laughs> um, but I think Hataru did a really good job for her introduction. She is very shy. You can see that in the first couple of minutes that she comes in. But I, I love the fact that they also thought it was weird that she, her dad, or who else she, she lives with, I'm guessing is her dad and her mom and maybe her grandfather as well, um, locked the key, locked the door to the house. And so she had a pair of keys so she could, you know, go home. But because of the fact is, you know, these three live in the country and such, they're like, well, oh, probably nothing really happens here. So it is okay to leave doors unlocked rather than someone like Hotaru who is coming in from Tokyo and doesn't know much about the country. So she's like, uh, I, I gotta be cautious and stuff. There's nothing wrong with that. I, I think that's a really smart strategic move and such. Um, We've technically had a conversation about locks and everything between America and Japan, so I'm not even going to get back in that conversation because that, yeah, because <laughs> it wasn't a bad conversation. It was an interesting conversation. It's just, I remember one time, uh, I think some, somebody got mad about something how I said, and I was just like, look, hey, people in America, um, we always keep our locks like on immediately with like because okay for me for an example like okay when I come home from work when it is being my mom and stuff specifically when she picks me up I always lock the door um there's never a moment in time where I don't keep that door locked even when I am if I'm home and I'm even in the living room watching tv that door is locked and then when I'm going to bed that chain is locked no you're not coming in regardless but no this is cute little first episode i am excited to see more of this because they're just four cute adorable girls just you know learning shit every single day and having an adventure every single day so i love this it's 10 out of 10 for me but go ahead and pause the video and i will see you guys in one second for episode two Alrighty, episode two and three two one go She like, I ain't got to teach anything, so. Yeah, definitely. Like, if, if, psh, if I didn't have to teach anything, psh, 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 I'd, be, I'd be like, all right, study hall for the rest of the day. I am catching my Z's. You got to feel bad for a teacher sometimes. Like, it, it's a real, it's a good job, but it is a rough job, depending on, like, kids that you have to deal with and stuff. I just know when I was a kid, I felt bad for some of my teachers.
Okay, sue me. Not sue me for money. You have to do it on your own. What's up, friend? Um. math for you. Girl. Right? We don't want you to hurt yourself. Uh-oh. <laughs> it surely did. Well, that's because you two set it up. But you are the shortest one. Besides Ren. Somebody. That did not sound good. That was a scream. Are you going to have to divide it in threes? 
And then if Hotaru comes, that's going to be four. How are you going to divide it in four? That means she's basically saying that she is, like, not wanting to eat candy or sweets because, you know, watching her figure. That's so cute. You're like, I'm going to treasure this for the rest of my life. I'm not even going to eat it. She's so adorable. See? <laughs> Right. Y'all have known each other for a long time. Right. So now you gotta pay your sister back. Giving her a piece of candy. Yeah, she gave it to her. Oh my god, hold on, don't cry. Oh, let her keep the damn candy. Yeah, go after school and get some more candy. There's nothing stronger than a fifth grader's tears. That's why you ask. Friend Natsuki Kamadi. Oh! You hang out? You gotta hang up. She's so cute. <laughs>
might get really hot though. <laughs> They're real lady like. Your fashion's better than me, oh my god! Come on, like, come on, baby, figure it out. That is Hotaru! Right then and there, that's when I would have been taking the glasses off and be like, but it's me, Hotaru. You're with her. You just don't know. Y'all ain't got a flashlight. We ain't got a phone. Nothing. We can't do, I'm gonna try not to shine my phone on y'all. We can't do this. We can't do that. Where, where is it? Hello? And you're just going? Sure.
really nice because when we are an adult, we get to we, when we have adult money, we can buy whatever the fuck we want, and it's the best thing in the world. Looks good though. baby <laughs> we do we have so many problems like how are we gonna pay our bills where is this coming from where is there coming from should i live paycheck to paycheck or not do not live paycheck to paycheck always save your money still treat yourself from time to time but not every single time So, <laughs> no, well, yeah, but no. I need you to kind of like, there we go. Thank you. Oh, blueberries. <laughs> now Tyra had a good time with it babe you just will never know oh <laughs> and like what are you talking about well Tyra like but, but we hung out today we, we went to go get shaved ice and then Kamari's gonna be like Huh? That was you? I thought that was somebody else. Like, oh my god. No, but their date was so cute. I loved Hotaru's outfit. Like, yes, yeah, she looked like a young adult. Oh my god. Like, go all out on that a cute little candy shop date. Like, so cute. Like, oh my god. I feel like because since she is from Tokyo... She's gonna have, like, the best fashions and such out of the four. Maybe Komari as, a, as like, second place. Like, Komari's outfit was really cute. It, it does give, like, still ladylike. But because of the fact is, like, I, I mean, because when I look at hers and when I look at freaking Kotaru's, it's more, if I had to choose out of the two, which one I would have worn, it would be Hotaru's. I think hers is a little more upscaled, like, I would wear Komari's, like, on a nice summery day, like, it, especially if it's one of those type of t-shirt dresses, um, or t-shirts that is very similar to that outfit, but where you can wear shorts and stuff, um, under it, because it looks super cute and stuff, and be like, yeah, look at me, I look so pretty, like, uh, but at the same time, And I ran away. Y'all running away from home. Well, I won't know until I watch it on Sunday. Because the, the, the goal for this week is to watch it on Sunday. Because 
I start my new job technically on Monday, but eh, we don't talk about that. But no, this was a really cute series, even though we're only two episodes in. Everybody is uber adorable. Like, this is diabetes cute. Like, I feel like I got diabetes just to watch this uh, at the end of this, regardless. Um, I feel like the, there is something I do want to say. Okay, so you know how normally, um, because Patreons know this and you guys don't, um, so I need to go ahead and establish this so that whoever non Patreons when they watch this on Monday, they're not they're not like, oh well what the heck is she going to do with this? So a while back ago, I think with the last long series with Minami Gay and a little bit of um the show that I started before Oh my god my SS. Um, I had made a vow to myself when it comes to shows that are over like 12 to 24 even with like several seasons in between for example with this show this show has um i think three seasons um a couple of ovas and a movie that potentially i am going to watch but i don't want it to be like how i did with um minami k anything else where it, it is a long series and i'm watching episodes back to back to back so this is what we're going to do um with this show and with any other series that is like this where it has like several seasons all together and such and the show is ultimately done um so i will be watching all of season one then i will go on to another show and then after that show i will come back to this show and such that's the thing and the deal that i have placed with all the patreon so of course it'll be season one of this then whatever i think the next thing after this i'll be watching the ovas for me for me nami k then i'll come back for this show for season two go to something else come back for season three go to something else watch the ovas and then probably the movie um as well but at different times but no, 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 like I said, this is very cute. This is wholesome. It's sweet. I do kind of hope that since we got to see an episode with both Komari and Hotaru, like, being together and doing things together, that we get one with Natsuki, uh, Natsumi or Natsuki? Sumi. Um, and Ren and seeing the thing that they're going to do. Because they seem both like the tomboys, um especially Kamari's younger sister because obviously you can see it she likes to do sports stuff so something tells me if they did do something over the weekend they probably went to go hunt some bugs or something because duh you do what you gotta do but yeah other than that guys that is my reaction to towards episodes one and two of Nyan Nyan by Yori if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the master squad and of course I will see you guys officially all next Monday for Patreons and next Saturday for everybody else for episodes three did I just say that rewind I'll see you guys next Monday for everybody else and next Saturday for Patreons for episodes three and four. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.